Hello, friends. I am Finish Lily. This video is part of my chemical process typing channel on YouTube. This video is about typing isometric program. All packages are prepared in such a manner that it can be easily customized. Open pipe are such for customized programs in my programs for piping series. For any program, it cannot run on auto -hold. The program is based totally on list programs and there are only for small symbols or blocks to be inserted as in other programs, due to which there is a lot of saving of disk space as well as the drawing also has very small size. Since the program is written in list, you can even modify it further as per your choice. The different typing entities are arranged on layers 1 to 6. Special dialog boxes are created to make the program more user-friendly. Minimum recommended hardware, piping isometrics can be run on personal computers, on a Pentium system with 30 to megabytes RAM, under Windows 95 or higher. Also, the SVGA card and VGA color monitor is recommended. It supports screen, pull-downs and icon menus, as well as Dialog boxes. The program is specifically written for any CAD program. It cannot run on auto. NSDA LLA MIOIN. The program is designed to run under any CAD program. For pitch and metric versions, separate menus are available for this program for metric units and for foot inch units for AutoCAD. How to draw with piping isometric program. To run this program copy all files in isometric folder to support directory of AutoCAD. If you copy them to some other folder in AutoCAD, click on tools and then options or preferences and then files and then plus sign of support file search path and then add and then browse and then select the folder folder. All files from zip file should be in this folder. At command prompt run Minoroid command type Minoroid and press enter. The dialog box will open showing AAS current menu in the group tab. Click on browse near file name text box. Change folder to up on card support and click on arrow of files of type box. Select menu template start off menu and select ISO underscore millimeter or ISO underscore inch with menu to be loaded. Click on load button. Click yes to continue. Click on menu bar tab and select ISO in menu group box. Insert ISO menu in left box at the end of items in menu bar box. Click on close. ISO menu will be loaded and start using pull down menu. The pull-down menu, ISO, he has all the ISO drawing options. Isometric pull-down menu, the pull-down menu, he has all the options of isometric drawing. Setup, run setup option from ISO pull-down menu. Select north direction. A drawing with all default values properly set will be set up automatically. The size of the drawing is 420 mm wide and 297 mm high for metric units and 17 inch wide and 11 inch high for foot inch units. In the dialog box that appears, enter drawing number and line number. Change P and ID number as well as YAG number using VB Edit. Whenever program asks for angle of line, please select angle in degrees. As per in Galata standard angles, dot zero degree for east, 90 degree for north, 180 degrees for west, 270 or minus 90 for south and any other angle in between. Nozzle, you can draw a different nozzle with four types of flanges attached to it, at any angle, using this option. When you click on this A dialog box will open, showing
showing the type of flange attached to nozzle. You can have flip on weld net, socket weld or lap joint flange. Select the proper flange connection. Dialog box will close and you are asked to select point location of nozzle on the pipeline and then through the dialog box. You can define nozzle side direction angle in degrees. Assign nozzle number or pump number to the nozzle. It will automatically draw the nozzle or flange and gasket and ride nozzle or pump number. Pipeline, when you click on this, this offers wealth option. Pipe, you can draw all pipelines with diameter from 15mm MP to 600mm MP using this option. It will set layer 2 line size underscore 1 and color of layer 2 sign. Draw similar 2 line command. Save. You can draw a sweep put on the pipe. Program asks you to select the pipeline, and then enter the description of the sleeve in dialog box, and it draws the sleeve, and write the description. Insulation, you can draw insulation symbol on a pipeline. Program asks you to select the pipeline, and then enter the description of insulation in the dialog box. Insulation symbol will be put on the line, and description is written on top of it. To show direction of flow of the line, use this option. Pick start point of arrow head on the line and point on the line towards tail of arrow. It will automatically draw the arrow and ride pipe and be above it. Triangle is a line is running at an angle other than north, south, east or west, or at an angle in vertical plane. Use this option to draw the other two sides of triangle. Program will draw pipeline joining to end points of triangle and you can continue pipe option. These lines can be used for hatching the triangle. Box is a line is running at an angle other than north, south, east or west, as well as at an angle in vertical plane. Use this option to draw the lower two sides as triangle option and the program asks to select vertical distance. A pipeline joining to end points of box is drawn and you can continue pipe option. These lines can be used for dimensioning the box. Slope. To write slope of a line on a pipeline, use this option. Program asks you to select the line, then a point in the direction of the slope. Text to be written on line for example 1 is to 100 and rise it automatically. After you select the text location, while drawing the triangle showing slope. Line type. You can change line type of the line to continuous, hidden, hidden to, hidden to, center, center to, center to, phantom and phantom to. Line break. You can put the line break at the end or anywhere in the line. Pick up insertion point and line break will be inserted. Support. Program will ask to select pipeline. If line is inclined, it will mark our support at the point you select, an arrow pointing upwards, and ride centrally through the support. If line is vertical, it will draw a horizontal line from that point and will write PS. Change layer to zero. If the particular entity is not part of the line, you can put it to layer zero and change its line type to hidden using this option. Program asks to select the number of entities and then change the same. Continue. If the pipeline is not included in this drawing, it can be drawn with this. Line is drawn dotted. it. The program will ask you to select first point then second point, through a dialog box, you can enter line number which appears above the line. You can also enter drawing number in which that line is drawn. It is written below the line as C, O, B, and line number. It will write center line elevation below it.
about when you click on this. This offers six options, which in turn offers a number of options with the help of dialog boxes. With slip on flanges, you can draw a globe, pluck, ball, chick, waiver check, diaphragm, butterfly and hover or PSV valves with this option. For check and wave for check valve, select line angle through dialog box. With weld neck flanges, you can draw a globe, pluck, ball, chick, waiver check, diaphragm, and butterfly valves with this option. For check and wave for check valve, select line and go through dialog box. With socket weld flanges, you can draw a globe, plump, ball, check valves with this option. For check valve, select line and go through dialog box. With lap joint flanges, you can draw a globe, plump, ball, check, waiver check, diaphragm, and butterfly valves with this option. For check and wave for check valve, select line and go through dialog box. Socket welded, you can draw a globe, plump, ball, and check valves with this option. For check valve, select line and go through dialog box. Screwed, you can draw a globe, plump, ball, and check valves with this option. For check valve, select line and go through dialog box. Special fittings, when you click on this, this offers six options through icon menu. Flow transmitter with slip on flanges. Flow transmitter with weld neck flanges. Control with special valve with slip on flanges. Control with special valve with weld neck flanges. Control with special valve with socket weld flanges. Spectacle blind. Fittings. When you click on this, this offers 11 options. Single flange. This has six options. Weld neck. Slip on. Socket weld, wrap, joint, screw, and blind flanges. Select the option by clicking it. The dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the pipeline path map unit is already set and from dialog box. Pick up the gasket side angle of pipeline. The flange will be inserted in the line. It will ask whether gasket is required. If you say yes, gasket will be put in line near the flange in the direction of float. Double flanges. This is for options. Weld neck. Slip on socket weld and lap joint. Select the option by clicking it. The dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the pipeline path map nearest is already set and the double flanges will be inserted in the line. It will put gaskets in line between two flange. Branch connection. This has nine options. Equal T, reducing T, well dollar, thread dollar, so code, nickel, stuck in, socket well T and screw T. Select the option by clicking it. The dialog box would appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the pipeline. You have to then indicate the angle of sight branch through dialog box. The branch connection will be inserted in the line. You can continue drawing the pipeline. In case of reducing T, well dollar, so code, nickel, thread dollar, and stubbing you will be as Select the size of branch pipe through dialog box. Only valid sizes will be offered for selection but reducing T, the point will have to be picked where the size will be written. For stub and select the pipe path map nearest already set, the weld will be put on pipe and you can draw the branching line. 
Elbows. You can draw 90 degree or 45 degree butt world elbows, as arcs or and two lines. You can also draw socket weld or screw elbows. Also, you can put a donut to indicate my haircut. Select the option by clicking it. Icons will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. For inserting the elbow, select the two pipelines near the emboss nap and is already set. The elbow will be inserted in the junction of two lines. If you are using dark option, the point will be put at the intersection of the two pipelines, which can be picked as no during dimensioning. In case of minor cut, it will ask you to select the line and it will put the weld at the end of the line. With your ship, you can draw a concentric, eccentric flash up, eccentric flash down or swage. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the point on the pipeline where larger end of reducer will be inserted. Pass nap nearest is already set and then a point on pipe towards the side of smaller end of reducer. You will be prompted for size of pipe on other side of reducer to a dialog box. Only valid sizes are available. You will then be asked to select the point where text will be written. Program will calculate offset distance and ride at time reducer in case of eccentric reducers only. In all cases, it will write size and type of reducer at the text insertion point. The reducer will be inserted in the line. An alert message will tell you to erase line on other side and draw pipeline with proper size. In case you select line angle as 90 degree or 270 degree for eccentric reducer, program ends action alerting that it can't be used in vertical lines. Strainers, this offers for options. Why? Strainer with slip on flanges. Why strainer with weld neck flanges? Bucket. Strainer with slip on flanges. Bucket. Strainer with weld neck flanges. Select the pipeline, and the strainers with flanges will be drawn in the line. Couplings, you can draw full and half, but weld or threaded. Victoric and hose couplings. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the pipeline. In the first four cases, you will be prompted for size of coupling through a dialog box. You have to then select, through dialog box, the angle of side branch. It will draw coupling and you can continue drawing pipeline. It will write size near the fitting. In case of hexagonal coupling, select the pipeline, and then size of coupling from the dialog box. The hexagonal coupling will be put in the line. It will write size near the fitting. In case of victoric coupling, select the pipeline and the coupling will be put in line. In case of hose coupling, you will be asked for location of insertion and then angle of hose coupling, and you will draw a hose coupling. Union. With this you can draw a union. Select the option by clicking it. Select the pipeline. The union will be inserted in the line. You will be asked whether it is but welded or threaded to draw the appropriate one. Hose. With this you can draw in line hose which is like a bellow in a line or flexible hose. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the pipeline for hose and from dialog box. Pick up the angle inline hose or flexible hose. The inline hose will be inserted in the pipe and flexible hose will be put at the point selected. Build of material bomb with this you can write bomb and edit it. There are 13 options. Table with dummy entries. Program will ask for number of entries. Type in the last number of bomb list. It will then ask for pipeline size. 
Program will draw the table with five more empty lines. It will write serial numbers, line size in all rows, and entry in quantity column. It will write desk in description column. These need to be edited later using DD edit command. Automatic build of materials. It searches for number of entities and rides in a table. Edit description. With this option, you can change text in description column by selection of piping item from pull down menu. Program will ask to select text to modify and then you can choose text from dialog boxes. Text will be written in place of desk. You can change or end description by editing ISO 10.LSP in notepad. Edit text by class set select proper set from pull down menu. And then program will ask you to select text to modify from the bottom table. Pick up text to modify and you can replace it by typing the text or by picking corresponding one in dialog box. You can also use short commands and display in command prompt. Stump bolt size. You can change the size of stump bolt in bomb table into waste. Diameter in inches and length in millimeter or diameter in millimeter and length in millimeters. You have to further select the standard and class of flanges and feet or BS. Select proper option from hold down menu. Then select the diameter of flange from dialog box and give number of sets of stub bolts. Program will calculate number of bolts required for those many sets and ask you to select text to replace the size and then quantity of stub bolt. Nut bolt size. You can change the size of machine bolt in bomb table into waist. Diameter in inches and length in millimeter or diameter in millimeter and length in millimeters. You have to further select the standard and class of flanges and feet or BS. Select proper option from hold down menu. Then select the diameter of flange from dialog box and give number of sets of nut bolts. Program will calculate number of bolts required for those many sets and ask you to select text to replace the size and then quantity of nut bolt. Change number by. In case there is any change in tag numbers, you can change the numbers from minus 5 to 5. Change text style to, with this you can change the style of text to either Romans or ISO 3098B. Oblique a text to, with this you can leave the text so add to fit its rotation angle. Text height, you can change text height of the text you select to 2, 2.5 and 3 millimeter root build of material. You should leave a gap of one row after valves, pipes, fittings, flanges, gaskets and stub bolts. It can be done by this option. Select text to move and it will move it by one column down. Find and replace. If there is any addition in tags, the number may go up. To change these numbers in tags and build of material table, use this option. The text that will be changed is shown on screen. Change the numbers in reverse order. Erase bomb slash tags. If you use this option, all the tags and bomb table with all entries will be erased. Dimensions. Dimensions have got five options. Dimensions for vertical lines. Dimensions for inclined lines. Isometric dimension symbols. Dim text height. Gasket sign. Dimensions for vertical lines. With this you can write dimensions in for inclined directions for a vertical line. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of dimension it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the two end points or press enter to select the line and indicate location of dimension text and end to dimension text. The dimension will be written on the line. In case of continued dimension, select last point option at location of dimension.
Just press enter when asked to indicate location of dimension text. Dimensions for inclined lines. With this you can write dimensions for inclined lines. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of dimension it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Select the two end points or press enter to select the line and indicate location of dimension text and end to dimension text. The dimension will be written on the line. In case of continued dimension select last point option at location of dimension. Just press enter when asked to indicate location of dimension text. Isodium symbols. With this option you can draw a column reference as well as write texts as plus 150 or less DYB below an existing dimension text. For this you pick up option from dialog box and then dimension text. It will be written below the dimension text. You can also write gently go down with a line from the end point of an elbow. Then text height. You can change text height of all the dimensions to 1, 1.5, 2, 2.5 and 3 millimeter gasket sign. You can put the gasket sign in dimension using this. Pick up end point to valve or snap and already set and pick up inclination angle from dialog box. Tags. With this you can draw school NOS, bubble, instrument tag and tag for gaskets and nut bolts. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of drawing it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. In case of spool no, enter the spool no as text and then pick the point where it should appear. Then select pipeline for fitting off map nearest is already set and then select second point on spool tag to draw the line indicating the spool. In case of bubble, select pipeline for fitting off map nearest is already set and then select second point where the tag note will be written. A tag note will be displayed. You can accept it by pressing or type a new number and press enter. In case of instrument number, select instrument valve, or fitting off map nearest is already set and then select second point where the tag note will be written. Fill in dialog box text for fitting type and number. Fitting tag will appear. In case of circle, select the earlier circle at the top point off map nearest is already set a tag note will be displayed. You can accept it by pressing enter key or type a new number. Hatch. With this you can draw vertical or horizontal hatch patterns in five different ways by selecting three lines. In the first two cases you can do horizontal hatching in two different ways. With third you can do vertical hatching. When you select the pipeline, program will ask for dimension of this pipe for each of the three pipes. It will then run zoom window command and ask you to select window to zoom the area where you right angle. After you right angle, it will zoom previous. With fourth and fifth option, you can draw vertical or horizontal hatch patterns by selecting three lines. After you select each line, program will ask for the length to be written as text. After hatch is drawn, program will write length of the three lines. It will then run zoom window command and ask you to select window to zoom the area where you right angle. After you right angle, it will zoom previous. Well, with this you can draw weld or ends. Six options are available. But weld included in this drawing will draw fill donut. But weld not included in this drawing will draw hollow circle, socket weld, screw end. Field weld, field fit weld. Select the option by clicking it. Dialog box will appear on screen showing the type of weld slash ends it will draw. Select the one required by double clicking. Then select pipeline. Pause now. Nearest is already set where the weld will and will be drawn instantly. Thanks for learning. If you like this video, please give a like to my channel and subscribe it.